Lance Reddick is the voice of Commander Zavala, leader of the city defenses and our Titan Vanguard. It is awesome to have you here with us today. It's pretty awesome to be here. So I want to talk to you about the character that you bring to life. Uh, when you approach the mic and you are Zavala, what influences your performance? Well, I mean, so uh, it's, 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 wow, that's actually not that simple a question because um, in some ways it's a very technical process of doing voice acting for a, a video game. Mm -hmm. But um, to me, aside from actually doing Shakespeare, it's the, probably the most Shakespearean role I've ever played. Um, he's very regal, he's very stoic, but at the same time, um, there's, uh, there's so much weight to everything he does. What makes a guardian a guardian? Take our first breath with no memory of who we were before. Yet, we are inexorably drawn to the light. We fight. We die. And we live again. We know that we were chosen for a reason, by something greater than ourselves. For as deep and wide as humanity's rivers have run, it has now been reduced to a precious few, needing something to believe in and a place to call home. This is what we have been called to, the future that we fight for. The future we will protect. Shaped by the fires of each new battle, we are forged and sharpened into what we must become for the fight ahead. What we have built is only the beginning, a symbol of what we can achieve, of who we are and our great purpose here. But the day may come when we will be tested, when all we hold dear is threatened. And then, we will see what each of us is truly made of. Times may be dark, but we are Earth's greatest hope. Look around you. A gathering of noble guardians new and old. Our home was attacked. I was they who fought against the endless onslaught. Despite the sacrifice of many brave guardians, we lost everything. The tower, the city, our home. I know you look to me in times of peril, but this is not my battle alone. It is time to avenge this injustice, for that is the duty of all guardians. So I ask you, who will stand with me? You play Destiny. Uh, yeah, I play Destiny a lot, actually. Almost, <laughs> I'm embarrassed to say this almost every day, yeah. Excuse me? One fucking guardian has been kicking your racist collective asses for nine years. They kill gods for fun and to turn them into guns for a meme. They genocide entire races for loot. They assassinated your last leader, cleaned out your daddy's ship while he wrote fan fiction about them and promptly fucked off to let you pick up the pieces. The only reason I didn't bring them here is because they casually began wielding the darkness to clap ass in new ways. All I have to do to make them end you 
is to tell them you have a fancy new gun or that Eris can make you into one. So, think about that before you tell us to bow to your sorry ass. Whether we wanted it or not, we've stepped into a war with the Cabal on Mars. So let's get to taking out their command one by one. Valus to Ark. From what I can gather, he commands the siege dancers from an Imperial land tank outside of Rubicon. He's well protected, but with the right team, we can punch through those defenses, take this beast out, and break their grip on Freehold. Indeed. To all my Destiny fans, and to all, all my followers on social media, thank you. Yesterday I was too tired to rest. Today, I'll find you in my dreams. I'm glad it was you standing with me.